Hey everybody, welcome back to Minor Stuff. I'm Matt. I'm Pat. We're, we're the, the Minor, Minor Brothers. Brothers. Today we're doing our bacon wagyu smash burger on the Blackstone. It's gonna be delicious. Let's get into it. All right, welcome back everybody. Before we get started, please subscribe to the channel, like this video, drop some comments down below. We've already done our smash burger. We're gonna do our Wagyu smash burger. We're actually working out some deal with a local farm that has a bunch of Wagyu. Wagyu stuff. Yeah, oh, um, the meat is delicious. We already had the Wagyu brisket, and oh my God. Best brisket I've ever, ever made, hands down. Yep, He's absolutely fantastic. So, uh, yeah, once we get all that stuff, we'll drop their, them down in the uh, description so you guys can get stuff from them. But they have fantastic meat. Uh, but today we're doing Wagyu Smash Burger. Before that, Matt, what are we drinking? So we're drinking some Ezra Brooks. This is a uh, store pick, and it's a nice hot barrel-proof one because, as you can see from our breath, it's cold up here. It's snowing yeah. outside. I feel like a kid who's literally smoking and, like... You're so cool. I wish I could be like you. You know, it, it's freezing, but this has been keeping us warm. That and the Blackstone Griddle's been keeping us warm. That's a true story. So this is our what, third cook of the day, and we're ready for some lunch now. Let's go over so some groceries. We're gonna get into these groceries. It's easy today, but we got some Wagyu beef. We have some bacon. We got some American cheese. We got some brioche buns, and we're gonna use a variety of seasonings on this one. But we have the bacon up there. We're not gonna need it because we're actually cooking so much bacon. We're cooking for the next cook after this too. Yep. So we're gonna have a ton of bacon grease down there. Uh, so Pat, let's just let's get right into let's this. Let's get thing. going. All right, we already got our bacon going. Some of it's already ready to be flipped here. As you can see where our hot spots are, everybody, our hot spots right here, right in the very middle. So you have to keep working your bacon up towards that point just to, to get it to cook. And some in his grill, the hot spots seem to be the lengthways, the way the burner actually goes. Bacon all here is more well than done. We keep all that delicious grease right there and as we get our burgers on. Now the key to a burger, a smash burger, is you don't want to work the meat too much into that ball in the beginning. So keep it kind of loose, keep the air in there, it's very important. While I'm doing this, Matt's going to prep our brioche buns. We're going to toast those because this all goes pretty quick from here on out. Once we get our smash down, we're going to put some Kinder's The Blend on there. A little bit of salt, pepper, garlic. We're going to hit it with a little bit of steak burger as well. And then last, we're going to do a little bit of bootleg burger from Blackstone as well. And now you'll see the key to this smash and you see all these juices sitting up on the top of the burger. That is what you're looking for. That means you got a nice good crust on the bottom and you're holding all that juice in, all that good flavor. So Matt's got a little bit of Duke's Mayo applied to our buns. We're gonna get those guys toasted. ready to flip these guys. Does not take long for them to already start getting good color. All right, Matt, why don't we hit that with a little bit of cheese. Fits, fits. 
All right, man, if you want to add some bacon to that. Wow, dude, these things look amazing. All right, everybody, we're back. We got this thing plated up now. It looks absolutely phenomenal. I like, I am so ready to just freaking smash this burger. You have no idea. I can't wait to. Now, normally we do our burger sauce on this. We're just doing this just for flavor. We just want to make, see, is there really a difference with the Wagyu beef versus regular beef? I'm ready to do All right. It. Dude, oh, look at how just amazing that looks. Let's dig in. Oh. <laughs> so juicy, so juicy. Dude, there is so much flavor on the crust part of that burger. This thing is freaking, I'm glad we did that burger sauce. You don't need burger sauce, this thing is. You need nothing for this. This thing is phenomenal. This Absolutely. is like the best thing that we've made. Like, this thing is incredible. Absolutely incredible. So would you say there's a difference between the regular beef and the Wagyu beef, Matt? I do. I think it's... I'm granted. Now, we cook a lot of the fat out. I think a lot of that fat, though, cooks in with flavor. Yeah, I agree. Fat is flavor. And that thing is packed with flavor. And there's so much juice, too. All that fat turns to that juice. Oh, man. Like, the cheese is just melted all... It's, it's literally the perfect... Like, I go to a diner. This is a freaking burger I want. This yep. thing is amazing. Absolutely delicious. So, Absolutely killer. Thank you everybody for coming and checking us out. Every Wednesday we got food cooks going on. Friday we're doing bourbon. Monday we're doing man shit. So make sure you come back to us, check us out. See all the other cool stuff we got coming up for you. All right, everybody, have a good day.